Okay, so most of the time when you've come up here before, you've noticed that these lights are lit up on the sliders on the board. And that is because I have actually already pre-programmed these in. So if I'm, let me take out all the lights real quick. If I'm here and I'm pointing up main house, you see how all the lights go on. Well, that's because I've actually created that slider in order to be programmed with all of the lights. Now we have a really helpful hint here. If you go right here and you look at this little piece of paper that we have taped to our board, we can tell you which lights are programmed to which uh, channel. And that means that you'll be able to basically program those lights into a slider. So I'm gonna show you how to do that. So let's say that I would like to program yellow. Let's say I need to make yellow into a slider. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually gonna click 64. So it looks like I have 64, 64 at full. So I'm gonna bring up that yellow light. Okay, then I'm gonna bring up the next two. So 66 at full, enter, and 70 at full, enter. So I've got all of the yellow lights up on the stage. Now I would like to program a slider. I could either reprogram a slider that already exists, or let's say I'm just going to do a new one. So I'm actually gonna click record, button record, and I'm actually gonna press on the slider, and you'll see the light lights up. On your computer screen, it will say record sub, and it will tell you the number of the sub. So this is sub 40. So it'll say record sub 40. Then I'm just gonna make sure I click enter so that it goes through. And I'm gonna clear that. Now, if I went back to having all my lights out, I'm just gonna test my slider. If I push the slider up, all of, this, all of the yellow lights turned on. Now this is really helpful whenever you're creating a new show, you've gotta reprogram the sliders. And it's also really helpful because you maybe you need like one or two special lights, kind of like we did in Cinderella, that we needed on at certain times. And so you can program that slider to come on. So we had like a moon over in the corner that we would bring up and we just had that one slider. It made it easier for when we were programming the whole show to have the sliders available to, to pull up. If you didn't have sliders, you would have to type this in every single time that you're trying to re-record a show. And you can imagine with like a hundred different cues in one show that could take a really long time.